Hello everybody. Okay, so yes, total different backdrop. This is my room on my dresser. I was on the porch, but it's raining like crap and I was I had just finished unboxing all of these people down here and seriously Jirachi. She keeps falling down, oh my gosh. Mm. And so I was out there and then he and I just started filming he's like and my dad comes in and is like Caroline, what are you still doing out here? I'm like, filming a video. He's like, you need to get out. I'm like, what? These aren't actually all the... This, those aren't their exact stands that they came with. Some of them didn't come with stands. That's why they're off to the side. It's not because they're not special or anything. But, um... But, we all picked the figures up first. My dad was trying to put them in a box. Figures from Japan that are very special and new that I just unboxed in a box. I was like, oh crap, no, I was not doing that. And, yeah. So... I decided I would now show them to you now that they were out of the box, and yeah, so let's go. Okay, here's my little Jirachi. I'll do the ones that um didn't have a stand first. Okay, come on Jirachi, I know you can stand up. There we go, like that. See? She just keeps... Mmm, okay. I got my Jirachi. My little Jirachi. Um, yeah. Isn't it cute? It can grant like a whole a wish for like a whole week every 300 years. And that actually gives me an idea for a show, so. Hmm. OMG, this is gonna be so fun. Let's go. Yeah, that's just an idea. And then Vaporeon is it's just so pretty and oh my gosh I love it. It's beautiful. Hi. I'm Vaporeon. I'm the mother of the Evolution family. You'll soon find out who the father is. And this is, um, I'm going to think of names to them later, but for now I'm just going to call them, I actually thought of one, no, no I didn't, I need to think of names for them and stuff. This is Leafeon, one of the daughters of the family. Hi, I'm Leafeon. Um, yeah. I'm thinking of names for them later, so... Yeah. Yumoga. Hi, Yumoga. I'm like so hyper. <laughs> I love cheesecake. Do you know what sugar does to me? It makes me more hyper. And I'm already hyper, so you know what happens? I'd say cheesecake and chocolate cake and chocolate pie and apple pie and peach pie. And they had a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of sugar in them. So I'm really, 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 really hyper now. Yay, party. Let's go. And then, oh my gosh, who is it? Who's that little? Oh yes, it's Shaman. Shaman, the pretty little Shaman. Look how cute it is, and it's sparkly. I love its little flowers. It's so adorable. It's so cute. Oh, and it smiles. It's right here on its belly. Shamans are just so adorable. And then, I said revolutionary form in the last episode, but it's the resolution, resolute form. I keep mixing it up. The resolute form. Yup. I know, and it, yeah, I, I keep forgetting and remembering the name I got for this dude. But I finally just remembered it. Hopefully I remember it when I'm writing down the names. But I won't tell you what it is now, because that would ruin the whole surprise. So it's my resolute form of Keldeo. Hi, I'm Espeon. And no, it's not the daughter. It's actually the father of the Evolution family. I decided that I was going to do a strange twist. And since no one ever seemed to pair up Espeon and Vaporeon. Because I didn't want to do like a normal couple. Like, like Umbreon. I don't even have an Umbreon yet. So I couldn't even do that. But 
I saw that no one like ever paired up a Vaporeon and Espeon. And they always put the Vaporeon as the and if they did, they like everyone thought Vaporeon was a boy and Espeon was a girl. So I did Espeon the boy and Vaporeon the girl. So I'm the dad. And you better and just so you know, I have psychic powers, so yeah, don't mess with me. I'm Lucario. I'm awesome. Okay, you know what is just jacked up? You see this? See this here? This is supposed to be my stand. It doesn't even fit my feet. Do you see how outrageous that is? That uh, I was just like, what? Yes, it's absolutely outrageous. Oh crap, I just knocked somebody over. And Flareon was already knocked over. Okay. Arceus. Oh yeah, it's Arceus. Hi, I'm Arceus. I'm more of a mysterious, less, um, jumpy, talkative, expressive person. I'm Arceus. I don't have time for that. My favorite evolution ever in the world, Glaceon, a daughter of the evolution family. <laughs> Hi, I'm Glaceon, and I just love, 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 love everything so much. My little sister, um, Evie, at the time, right now, that'll probably have a new name, is like one of the sweetest, most kind people ever. Leafyon and I hang out with her. Yeah. Because we're nice, and she's nice, and so, yeah. And then Evie. My favorite Pokemon ever. Hi, my name's Evie. I'm kind of shy when I meet people, but after I get to know you all better, I'm positively, absolutely, pretty, pretty, absolutely sure that I will love, love, love you. Because I like to talk a lot once I meet someone. You feel like Glacian are my only friendly siblings. So they hang out with me, and we talk. And I'm pretty grown up for my age, so we get to talk about older things, too. Well, that's all I've got to say for now. I'm hoping on making new friends, but I'm kind of shy of making new friends. Because we just moved to the town where everyone lives. And, ba bam Victini! Victini. I might have to do a part two of this, don't hurry came with this, it helps it stand up a little bit better, yeah. Hi, I'm Victini. Um, I bring victory who, to whoever I think deserves it at the time. So, yeah. Hi, I'm Flareon. Even though I look like a boy, I am one of the sisters. <sighs> There's only one boy, and that's Jolteon. We hang out because, I mean, like, He's the only, like, you know, the only person who's, like, cool in this family. Yeah. So, I gotta go. Hi, I'm Meloetta's other form. I forgot what it was called. I'll have to look it up in my new Pokemon book that I got for Christmas. Is it in here right now? I don't think so, but I'll show you when I do that. I forgot what form it was. Okay. Oh, crud. It's stand fell off. Yeah. Fix that later. Um, wait. Put the camera down. I'll try to do this as fast as I can. Oh my gosh, this is so hard. Get. There we go, I did it. Okay. So yeah. We're one of, uh, we're also one of the council. Meloed and I are the council. And the council tells magical, mystical things that happen. They can make me into the future. I mean, we're second shapes anyway. Hi, I'm Meloetta. You know, the original form of her. Our stains just keep falling off, don't they? Ugh. Well, I like to sing, and she likes to fight, and we're part of the council. Hi to all my 
well, we if we ever tell mystical stories, that will help. That's how we really do it. I will sing a song about the story, and she'll act it out because she's also a very good actor. Yeah, but she is not as good as um, Bellatrix. Bellatrix is like the best actor ever. Yes, I just can't. Mm -hmm. I just complimented myself, y'all. I am the best actor ever. Hi, I'm Dolteon. I'm like the only boy in the family. Other than my dad. But he's suck. He's horrible. I don't like him. I'm like the only cool person. I hang out with Flareon. She's the only cool girl in the world. Man, if we weren't sisters, we'd probably be dating each other. If we weren't siblings, you'd probably be dating each other. Yeah. Seriously. We're like the only cool people in this family. So we hang out with each other because we're the only two cool people. Oh, I also forgot to mention I'm Arceus and I'm also part of the council. This is the fourth member of the council, Darkrai. Hello. I am like Arceus. Emotionless. Well, not emotionless, but I do not sound with emotions in my voice like a lot of other people here do. Arceus and I are very good friends, and we've been friends ever since we both became part of the council. Or, that's just for short. It's really the Guardian Council. We guard this place that the Pokemon live in. It's quite simple. Okay, I'm not done yet. Bam, y'all. Party all night. Party. I got a Zorark, and it's awesome. Mm. So, yeah, this is Zorark. It's a boy, for your information. Yep. Mm-hmm. It's awesome. And I have a secret that no one knows but me about the Zorark and Eevee. They're not going to date. I don't know, but they're just special, because I'm going to, it's, these people, these Pokemon, oh man, I'll just, man, you just made me tell you, the Eevee and Zorak are going to be dedicated to my friends, oh, one, including my special PS, but I bet she can't guess which one she's going to be, I just bet she can't guess, she actually told me the name of what she wants it to be, but I bet she will never be able to guess which one she's going to be, is she going to be the Zorak or the Eevee? She'll never guess. <laughs> yeah. I'm evil. Oh. Okay. And here is Zekrom. Oh my gosh. Peace. Sup. I'm Zekrom. I'm awesome for that. I have a giant tail. Huge wings. And my hands are connected to my wings, which is kind of creepy. Yeah. Mmm. And this is Reshiram. She has her awesome wings, her tail, her feet. Her, her ta I just love Reshiram's tail. It's awesome. So, yeah, it's Reshiram. Before we go, Zekrom has something to say. Yes, I know they're genderless, but I'm kind of, um... Zekrom is kind of, um... <laughs> yeah. Not aware of that. Yeah, so he thinks Reshiram is hot. Yeah. Zekrom is unaware of that. I always thought Zekroms were kind of childish. Yeah, I don't know why, but I just do, so. I made him, he's kind of more childish and kiddish than Reshiram. She's more solemn. If you're wondering why it's there, it's because it's broken and we never returned it, so now we can't. And we can't do it anyway because yeah, the cat broke it. <sighs> so that's about it. See you guys later. Party all night. Party all night. Move out of the way. Yeah. Well, I'll see you guys later. This is just part one. Part two is coming soon, and that's when I'm actually going to make an episode. No, it's actually no, it's actually not. It's just going to like reveal the names. This is part one. Part two is where I reveal the names. So, yeah. I probably will upload it soon because I'm kind of bored. And I don't really want to sit there whole time. So, I will see you all later. Goodbye.